Dog, all about Mars, written by Mary Blake, illustrated by Link Ness. This is Levy, a boy, and this is Space Dog, a space traveler. Levy and Space Dog have just been to the Earth's moon. Now they are ready to explore other planets. Where are we going now, Space Dog? Levy asked. Mars, Earth's neighbor, replied Space Dog. I heard about Mars. It's red, said Levy. Yes, and rocky, Space Dog replied. And half the size of Earth. Soon they were nearing Mars. Here we are! Exclaimed Space Dog, landing the ship with a little bump. That was fast, said Levy. Can we get out? That's what we're here for, said Space Dog, smiling. Wow, it's cold, even with my spacesuit, said Levy. As he climbed out of the ship, yes, said Space Dog. Even though it's summer here now, why isn't it hot here in summer like on Earth? Asked Levy. Because Mars is farther from the sun than Earth. Answered Space Dog. So why is it red? Asked Levy. Because on Mars. The soil contains iron oxide. Iron oxide is red. Space Dog answered. Hey, Space Dog, is that a volcano? Asked Levy. Exactly. Replied Space Dog. There are mountains and canyons on Mars too. Martians live here, right? Asked Levy. I've never seen them. Or any other living creature until now," replied Space Dog. "Until now," repeated Levy. "Yes, until now," said Space Dog, laughing. "Now I see, Levy. No one else has ever traveled to Mars. Only Space Dog and Levy." "Now," said Space Dog, "say goodbye to Mars and head back to our ship." Other planets are waiting for us. Let's go," said Levy. He couldn't wait to set his feet on another amazing planet.